Hi, my name is James Lovridge, I'm a stand-up comedian, and in October last year, a heckler glassed me whilst I was performing on stage. Now, if you'd like to jump forward towards the action, feel free to click here and it will take you straight to the glassing. But the reason that I'm talking to you at the moment is because although I have lots of CCTV footage of the gig, I only have a limited bit of audio due to someone filming it on their mobile phone at the back of the room. So the gig itself had actually been going really well. Uh, the audience were really enjoying themselves, the other comedians had been fantastic. Uh, and I was just wrapping up the night before bringing the final act on when I decided to mention that I was from Essex. Now usually that wouldn't be cause for a fight or a glassing, but there was a man in the crowd who was also from Essex, uh, decided to shout out and try and make out that his area was better than mine, which I kind of explained is a redundant conversation because all of it's crap and it's not the kind of thing you care about once you're past 16 years of age. The back and forth went on for about five minutes, but I'll condense it down to just a few words. Uh, I took the piss out of him, he didn't find it funny, and that's when he decided to rush to the stage and throw his drink over me. Now, most of it misses me and goes over the ceiling, which I kind of find quite funny. And then this is the point he's kind of getting escorted out and I point out that his drink's gone over my head just like my jokes went over his. And never want to miss up on an opportunity, I decided to take my top off and dance underneath the beer that's dripping from the ceiling. I also notice there's an ice bucket by my foot and try my best to reenact flash dance. And it's about now the audio kicks in. So, enjoy. I like to group in such a school that you won't let you bully it. Look at me now, son. She got pretty real. The guy got escorted out, we called the police, uh, and they said, was anyone hit? They said, almost. Um, they said no crime had been committed. I was like, yeah, it kind of has. Uh, but on the plus side, guys, at the end of it, uh, I got eight new Twitter followers. So that was one Twitter follower for every shard of glass that I picked out my back hand, right? <laughs> uh, but weirdly, you know, I've been doing comedy for six years, and something like that has never happened. It's very, very rare. Uh, this whole idea that you kind of get hecklers at comedy clubs doesn't happen as much as you think. Uh, but when it does happen, Jesus Christ, it really happened. So, uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed that video. Sorry you had to see my face do this bit to camera. I know it's a bit awkward. People just want to see the glass and then go. Uh, but if you'd like to see more of my stuff where I don't get attacked, uh, feel free to kind of click here. Um, or I've got a whole Edinburgh show that I did a couple of years ago you could do there. Uh, and if you're going to be in Edinburgh, come see me. Don't glass me. That would be a bit shit. Uh, uh, but yeah, I'm sure it's called Castles in the Sand, and uh, I'll hopefully see you there. Alright, cheers!